What is fake news? Fake news can mean different things to different people. It can mean false information disguised as news to deceive and manipulate. But it also can designate mainstream media organizations that paint Donald Trump in a less positive light. The terms misinformation, disinformation and malinformation allow us to better understand the complex context of information disorder and the main issues at stake regarding the production and dissemination of information today. However, fake news is anything but new. It may be as old as humankind itself. Particularly since the 19th century, the issue of false information has been a source of debate and even concern. The Great Moon Hoax in 1835 by the New York newspaper The Sun is one of many stories published then by sensationalist newspapers also known as Yellow Press or Tabloid Press. The radio broadcast of War of the Worlds by Orson Welles in 1938 was blamed for having caused widespread panic in the US, but at the same time newspapers may have exaggerated its impact on radio listeners. The three-minute TV report Spaghetti Trees, broadcast by the BBC in 1957, is still recalled as one of the great hoaxes ever, but it was a mere April Fool's Day prank. Today, people increasingly obtain most of the information from the internet, and especially from the social media. Still waiting to be fully understood is the role of personalization algorithms in potentiating individual isolation and social polarization, eventually leading to the so-called filter bubble effect. This brings new challenges and threats to democracies, as demonstrated by the Russian interference in the 2016 US presidential election. The rise of new forms of authoritarianism and control supported by digital technologies go beyond the dystopian society envisioned by George Orwell in 1984, with China leading the way for others to follow. So, what can you do about it? To start with, be conscious, be critical and be autonomous about everything you read, write and share. Think. Rethink.